Hey guys, Shaybear1000 here again. Today, we're going to be unboxing and reviewing and trying out this uh, cheap dash cam we got here as seen on TV. Stay tuned, let's see what it's all about. Okay guys, let's go ahead and open up this uh, I got this, we gave $20 for it, as seen on TV. Just a cheap dash cam. This is full high def. You know, that's not true. It's probably 720 or something. But, you know, you never know. Let's check it out. I figured for 20 bucks, you know, it's worth that to, to make a video. And like I said in the last video, Monkey, she does a lot of driving. You know, Sometimes 150 miles a day, sometimes just 100, but she does a lot of driving. She sees a lot of incidents, a lot of weird stuff, and um, so we've been wanting to get a dash cam. I thought, well, they make better ones, and, and they're cheap. You can get fairly decent ones for 100 bucks. This is 20 bucks. It's going to be a cheap thing, but we thought, what the hell, let's try it, right? So let's open this up, and this must be... Everything we need for it in here. So here's the camera itself. There's the camera. See, it's <laughs> night capable or capable of, but all it is is these lights come on. I'm 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 just kind of wondering if they're going to glare back, you know, at night, glare back off the windshield. I don't know. We'll have to see at night time. But it's just like a little two and a half inch screen or something. Let's pull that off of there, and I am going to leave the protective coating on it right now. And so there it is so far. I mean, looks like a power cord on an off switch. Apparently, I haven't read up on it yet. Uh, let's see what's this. This must be where the memory card goes. So we're going to get that put in there. And here. Here is the, uh, the suction cup to put it on your windshield. And you put it, put it there and then you pull that down and it'll suck up and whatever. So, and it goes in the top part right there in that little hole there. It'll screw in there. I don't know why, I'm sorry guys, I keep forgetting you're down here. Let's get this spun around. And so the camera will be like that. That way it's facing out towards the the uh, towards the street. It's supposed to record audio as well. So we've got oh my goodness, I can't believe this. It came with a memory card. I don't know what size, guys, but there we go. It came with a memory card, so that's cool. It'll hold up to a 32 gig. Um, here's some sticky things. I'm guessing if you want to mount it different ways. Like I said, I haven't read the instructions on it. You're seeing what I'm seeing for the first time as well. But I'll, I'll check it out before we take it out to the truck. And uh, USB. So I can either take the card out and put it to import in the PC or just plug that directly into the PC. Let's see. Mm, this must be the battery. Yep, there's the battery. And this is the, um, you plug it in your cigarette lighter or power source. Now they just call them AC power sources or whatever. Um, or DC power sources. Same thing as a cigarette lighter, but we have three in the truck. Only one of them working. I think there's a blown fuse in there. I have to check it. But uh, so anyway, there's that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to read up on this, guys, and I'm going to get back with you here in just a minute. So stay tuned, guys. All right, guys. Let's check this thing out. See what's going on here. Let's see how this works. Yeah. Take 
a little dry here. Show you our little park up here at the end of the street. Thing. I was right, it is 720. Uh, it's not 1080p, it's 720. But. You're supposed to charge this thing for three to five hours before using it or it will shut down once the battery is low. I don't know why it does that because, I mean, I'm plugged into the car charger, so, yeah, whatever, right? So, get home. So, there we go, guys. I am going to take you into the house and uh, get this and see how this does. Alright guys, stick with me please. Thank you. Oh guys. There you have it. You saw the clip. Um, <laughs> yikes. Number one, you saw it's very crappy. Even for 720, that is crappy. And um, also, I don't know if you could tell it or not, but the sound is not synced. Uh, I did format the new card and I'll try it again here after a bit. did say to charge for three to five hours, but in order for it to charge in the truck that long, you got to have the key on. Um, just the way it is, the cigarette lighter will not work if the key's not on. So I'm not going to leave it set out there and run. Uh, so I've got it plugged in here to uh, USB. It's charging. It did say if it's if it's low, it, it may not function properly, but that's ridiculous. And the sound was just like, I'm like watching it back on the PC going, what the freak? Crazy. I mean, for 20 bucks, guys, don't waste your money. Pay another 30 
or $50 one and you can actually get 1080 and they're okay. This I figured, let's give it a shot. I mean, uh, so far, no, it's junk. It's like maybe a $10 camera tops for, you know, a kid to play with. I mean, it's, I'm not impressed with it at all. No, full high def. I mean, 720 is even better than that, guys. Come on. So, But I'm going to go ahead and charge it. I formatted the card. Another thing, that card that they gave me, that's not a card, guys. You know what that is? It's an adapter for a micro mini SD card. But it does have a case. I mean, for 20 bucks, you might as well say I bought a charger and a USB, a short USB cord, by the way. And it will... I mean, as soon, as soon as I plugged it in to, to start charging it, it started recording. So, it does record automatically, but, I mean, as far as, as far as quality, I mean, sound, that sucks. So, I think for her, uh, I'll just get her, you know, a good $100 one. I mean, you can get really, really, you can spend what you want on a real super nice one, but a 50 to 100 dollar one is fine i've seen them and you know they're 1080 they're just like this camera here but for 20 bucks is it worth it no was it worth it to me to make a video for my fine viewers of course it was <laughs> of course it was who gives a crap right so anyway please share my videos you know <laughs> so but anyway guys there you go i mean uh if for some reason it it works starts working better after it's charged which i highly doubt you know i'll let you know but uh <laughs> i don't see that happening guys i mean so there you go junk <laughs> buy it for your kid to play with i don't know even for that i mean that's a little pricey 20 bucks for something like that it's pretty stupid um, did bounce around a little bit I mean, I know what you guys are going to say, oh, you know, all my, all my haters out there. Yeah, well, we expect for 20 bucks. That's true, but I would expect a little more than that. I mean, I bought, you know, um, like Odd Lot brands or Big Lots or whatever. I, I bought 720 cameras there that, I mean, other than being clear full screen, uh, they work fine, you know. They were still kind of crappy, but I mean, not as crappy as that for 20 bucks. So people see that, go, oh, I need a dash cam, I need a dash cam. <laughs> Just spend the extra money and get you a good one if you're going to do a lot of filming. She's been wanting one for a long time, so I thought I'd give it a shot, but ah, you know what? Her birthday's coming up next month, so without trying to spoil anything, maybe we'll just have to see what's what's happening you know but anyway guys again thanks for watching there's another one for you and you know if if you're looking to buy one of these right here you know as seen on tv dash cam pro <laughs> yeah it's a pro piece of shit anyway guys it shouldn't say dash cam pro it should say dash cam pos because that's what it is anyway guys this is worth it for you so again thanks for watching and stay tuned for our next video and oh by the way if you see this nancy tonight email email me i think you got my email address email me uh like i said we're going to go to a flea market in the morning let me know what what kind of train stuff you're looking for we've been on the lookout and i can't i keep forgetting what what scale that you're running if there's anything you need in case we run across it um you know we can pick it up for you so that being said guys remember shea bear the myth the man the legend i'm gone for now bye bye guys have a good one